In this video, I'll show you how to automatically draft emails in Zoho Mail from Google Sheet. So here, I'm going to connect to Google Sheets and Zoho Mail in such a way that every time I'm going to add the email content, the subject line and the sender email address here inside Google Sheets, using this data, an email will be drafted automatically inside Zoho Mail. Yes, it is possible. And after creating this automation, you do not have to manually copy the email details and compose or draft the emails one by one again and again simply create this automation with the help of an automation software and after that simply add the details here and get your email drafted automatically into the zoho mail want to create this automation for yourself come with me and i'll show you the whole process step by step so this is my spreadsheet where I have added all the email details, basically the subject line, the content and the sender email address. And I'm going to connect this spreadsheet with the Zoho email so that I can automatically draft these emails inside Zoho email without doing anything manually. And for that, I'll have to connect these two applications with the help of Pabli Connect, which is an amazing integration and automation software via which you can easily connect multiple applications and automate your task. And you can also reach here by typing pabli.com slash connect. I will also attach this link into my description box for your reference. Now, if you are a new user of Pabli Connect, you will have to sign up for free where you will also get free tasks every month in your account in order to test these kinds of amazing automation. Well, I'm already an existing user of Pabli Connect. So that is why firstly, I have clicked on sign in. Then I have clicked on Pabli Connect access now button. And this is how I have reached to the dashboard of Pabli Connect. And after reaching here, Firstly, click on this blue button that is create workflow and provide a random name to your workflow to your automation. Okay, so I'm going to provide the name something like draft emails automatically from Google Sheets data. Okay, you can provide any random name. Let me also correct this spelling. Simply click on create and after this, you will find two boxes in front of you. So these are basically trigger and action. So trigger means when this happens, action means do this. So whenever this happens, do this. Understand with an example also. Let's say whenever a sale happen in a payment gateway application, automatically send an email via Gmail application. And here, according to our use case, whenever the data is added inside Zoho mail application, sorry, inside Google Sheets application, automatically send the email automatically draft an email inside Zoho mail application. Okay, so this is how you need to always select the applications in which you are building an automation. And I'm going to do the setup of Zoho mail later. Let me first do the setup of this Google sheet. But before that, I am going to correct the branding of this Google sheets, it should be capital. Okay, click on update. And the idea here is I'm going to connect this spreadsheet with the Pabli connect so that firstly, I can capture the details inside Pabli Connect and in the trigger even I have selected this new or updated spreadsheet row which means whenever I am adding a new data or whenever I am updating any data inside row this automation should trigger or this automation should send the data to Pabli Connect okay so how I am going to connect this spreadsheet basically with the help of this webhook URL so you need to follow these instructions one by one okay so copy this webhook URL go back to your spreadsheet here you will find an option of extension click on add-ons click on get add-ons and here firstly search for the Pabli connect webbooks add-on all right Pabli connect webbooks add-on okay and this add-on is already installed into my account here you can see but you will have to firstly install this add-on because once you will install this add-on you will have to again click on extension and this is how you will have to access this add-on because you will have to click on this initial setup and in this initial setup we are going to provide the same webbook url which we have received via public connect all right so i am pasting the same webbook url asking for the trigger column basically the column on the filling of which this automation should trigger or this automation should send the data to Pabli Connect. Okay, you'll have to read the instructions also. The trigger column will be a final data column on which if the data is added, the whole of that row data will be sent to the webhook URL. Okay, so in this particular case, I want that as soon as the data is filled up to C column, this automation should trigger. So that is why I have added the trigger column as C and clicked on send test button and you will see 
that the tested data sent successfully which means the data has been sent to pabli connect and here you can see the response is received and let me show you the details one by one here we have selected we have provided the trigger column as c yes it is the same the spreadsheet name is emails to be draft and yes it is the same name okay how about i click on the submit and first close this dialog box okay here you can see the setup configured successfully simply close this particular box okay and here email subject line the email content the send email to and the very first data i have is regarding affiliate partnership okay so here let me show you the details one by one email subject line yes it is the same regarding affiliate partnership and let us also check the email content okay so here we have received the email content as hello john i am sonam from babli team i am sending this email regarding affiliate partnership start promoting public products and get 30% recurring commission on every sale okay coming back and yes it is the same email and the sender email address is admin at the rate pablitude.com and yes it is the same data okay so the presence of this data clearly shows that the first step of our automation which was connecting google sheets and pabli connect and capturing the data here is working absolutely fine and here i would like to tell you two more very important things so the first thing is whenever you are working with the google sheets automation and pabli connect make sure either you work in the incognito window or multiple gmail accounts should not be logged in otherwise there will be an error in sending the data into the google sheets i'm repeating this once again either work into the incognito window or multiple accounts should not be logged in at the same time okay and second thing is the very first time we have actually get the data of the first row but just in case if you want this automation to work in real time let's say if you want this automation to work in such a way that every time you are adding the data up to the c column in next row that data should be captured via pabli connect automatically in real time for that you will have to enable this interesting option that is send on event which means every time some event is happening here basically here the event means adding of a data in a new row okay so every time some event is happening here the data should get sent okay but just in case if you want to create this automation in bulk you will have to enable this send all data okay i'll show you i'll discuss this later in the video okay coming back to pabli connect and now since we have the data all the data we are going to compose or draft an email inside zoho mail so firstly you will have to search for the application and secondly you will have to select that specific action event so i am going to select i have selected this create draft since i want to select the same simply click on connect click on add new connection and just like we have connected first google sheets with pabli connect now we are going to connect zoho mail with the pabli connect okay i'll add this zoho.com because my domain is actually zoho.com only coming back here let me paste to the same click on save and this is how the author organization will be successful okay firstly i'll have to provide the access and since i'm already logged in into the zoho mail account in some different app so it is simply asking me for the access the authorization is successful and the zoho mail is connected with pabli connect asking for the account id so i just have a single id only so i'll go with the same only okay and asking for the two basically the recipient email address okay so from where i am going to add this data i don't need to manually add the above data here okay i am going to map this whole data and mapping is very simple inside pabli connect simply click on this particular field and you will find the above data here in the drop down okay and let me search for that email address and here you can see i have searched it with the help of at the rate and finally i have provided the sender email address is this just in case if you want to add more uh, email address you can use this comma okay asking for the cc bcc so currently i will leave these fleets blank okay i'm sorry for that asking for for the from email address so from you from where you can actually get this email address let me show you again go back to your zoho mail and here you will find an option of settings at the right hand side okay and in this settings option you will have to scroll down a little bit and then you will find an option of mail accounts 
and here you can see a mail default from email address has been provided and it is the same email address uh, which you have provided which you have selected at the time of setup of this account okay so let me copy this particular email address all right so i have copied the same coming back to pably connect and i will paste the same email address here all right Alright, so I have pasted the same asking for the subject line. So again, I have captured the subject line also from the Google Sheets data. So I'm going to map it here asking for the email content type. So it will be HTML only. Okay, just in case if you want to select this plain text, you can also go with the same the body content. So I also have the email content. Okay, so this is how using the Google Sheets data, you can create you can draft emails inside Zoho mail. I have clicked on Zoho save and send test request now going back to my draft section and here i'll have to wait for the response and here you can see the same email has been drafted automatically the subject line is same that is regarding affiliate partnership and yes it is the same subject line which i have mentioned into my google sheets coming back to my zoho mail and hello john i'm sonam from pabli team i'm sending the email regarding affiliate partnership start promoting pabli products and get 30 percent recurring commission on every sale and here we have the from email address also okay and we even have the sender email address okay so this is how now onwards you just need to add your data inside the google sheets and the emails will be drafted automatically you do not have to do anything manually simply create this automation inside pably connect just once after that sit back and relax because pably connect will take care of all the tasks in the back end you do not have to do anything manually and whatever the details here i have mapped these details will be replaced automatically okay so what will happen every time i'm going to add the new details these new details will be replaced will replace these existing values okay so this is how this automation is going to take place and that is why mapping is really important inside public connect and whatever the details you are going to add manually in these fields that detail will remain same okay let me show you how this automation will work in real time okay so what i'm going to do is i am going to delete this particular entry okay firstly and then i will save this entry somewhere okay let me first open the notepad and here i will open i will save this entry all right so i have added this entry now i am going to delete this entry okay again i will cut this entry okay i have also deleted this okay and i'll have to make sure that the send on event option should be enabled okay so i have finally enabled this option how you can check whether this option is enabled or not with the help of this tick mark okay now finally i will be adding second data second row okay i'll be filling out the data inside second row assume that i am actually i want to compose a new email okay so i have added the details basically i have pasted the details i can i think the details have not been pasted all right so all right so i have pasted the details now i will have to wait for that email and here you can see right in front of you this number has changed from two to three and we have that very same email which has got created in fact twice okay because i have pasted that entry twice hello dave i'm really happy to announce you that the integration of public connect will with your service is now completed you can share this good news with your audience well the spelling of audience is not correct thanks sonam pabli team and here we have all the details coming back to pably connect okay coming back to google sheets and this is how you can make this done just in case if you want this automation to work in bulk you will have to enable which particular option basically the send on even okay so firstly i'm going to disable this option again coming back here firstly i'm going to paste this data okay and then i'm going to paste this this data also okay interested in promoting the pably on your channel all right so i'll have to correct the things i'll have to first delete it and then i'll have to again add this particular content one by one okay interested in promoting uh or pably on your channel yes i am interested okay so i have pasted the very same subject line now i am going to copy this content also all right so i have copied the very same content as well let me paste the same lastly i am going to add the email address okay that is demo at 
the rate pabdytudes.com okay and now right in front of you i will enable this send on send all event okay let me go back here you can see send all event before that let us come back here and how about we delete all the existing emails right in front of you okay so i am going to delete all the existing emails forever now coming back to my google sheets let me enable this particular send all data options it is still working going back to my zoho mail and here you can see in bulk also those emails have been drafted automatically okay so this is the power of pabli connect power of automation not just these applications you can integrate multiple applications and automate your business with pabli connect you can ask your queries at forum.pabli.com my team will surely answer to your questions this is the website of pabli connect and for the latest updates of pabli connect and unique automation ideas you can join our facebook group that is formget.deals if you have found this video helpful in any way share it with your friends and colleagues and also help them to automate their business like share and subscribe thank you for watching this video